Hi guys and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. Today we're going to be learning how to build an Avro Vulcan, which is a kind of British uh, bomber which did carry our first nuclear deterrent as well, so it's quite a cool kind of jet jet bomber. Um, so the main materials you're going to need for this one are black wall buttons, never brick fence, cobblestone slab, stone stairs, grey wall, uh, glass, and a block of iron. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing you need to do is just place down one piece of black wall and then just count back from here seven blocks. I'm going to use slabs to show you what exactly I mean. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And you're going to go out two on each side of these. So just you can put this in if you want to, just to make sure you get it right. And then you're just going to have basically a black piece of wall, a block, and a black piece of wall, uh, which will be your upper wheels. And these are going to be joined together right in the middle with never break fence. And then all you need to do to finish this off is grab your buttons, put these on the kind of on each of these kind of faces that you've got here. As these are your wheels, even if you're building this one in the air, I still recommend putting in these as they're a really good placeholder. And then if you grab your never break fence and just go up by one on each of these never break fences here, just like that, and we'll get on to the next bit. And then if we come to the front and just go forward by four, this is just gonna be a place obviously you got one, two, three, and four. This is where you've got two kind of slabs, so we don't actually need those four, it's just to count the, you know, you made sure that you've got uh, one, two, three, four blocks here, like that. And then on the back, what we're going to do is we're going to have these two here just to count again, so we're just going to go back by two. And this time it goes onto the side part here, so then this is going to be six. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six. It's the same on the other side, so you got one, two, three, four, five, six. And we can get rid of these part here so we're just going back by two blocks and that's just gonna be your kind of spacing here and you got a six so you got one two three four five six and one two three four five six like that and we'll get onto the next layer okay so for the next layer what you're gonna do is just of these slabs we placed earlier what we're gonna do is come forwards by five blocks in total so you've got one here so you got one two three four and five this goes back in total by a total of 27. So you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. Just like that. So that last block will be right in line with these two slabs here. Then what you're going to do is you're going to come in one block from the back and go 16 and just add 16 blocks. So you've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Like that so you can do the same on the other side as well uh, you might as well do the wing on both sides at the same time I'll just lay out this part so you got one two three four four just recount that one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen and if we go back to this one here so now this one's gonna be showing three so you go one two three so you've got three blocks showing and if we go inwards we're gonna have a two so you got one two so you got two showing this way now the next one is going to be three sets of one, so you've got one, two, and three. So if I just take out these blocks, it might be easier for you guys to see exactly what I'm doing at the end. So you've got three showing, two showing, one, two, three, single one pieces here. Now what we're going to do is going to have two blocks, but it's going this way this time, so it's, it switched the direction on the wing here to this side. And then you have four sets of one, so you've got one, two, three, and four. And then you're gonna have a two, so you've got two going this way again. And then a one, one, and then you're gonna have three blocks here, so you got one, two, and three like that. So there's your wing shape, so you need to copy that onto the other side. It's a bit more uh, kind of complicated. complicated. There's a couple more slabs and stuff we need to put on. If I just go over it quickly. So you've got three showing, two showing, one, one, one. This is when it switches direction now, so you're looking at it this way. So you've got two, one, 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 two, one, one, and then you just have these three, which are right on the side here. So copy this onto the other side. So that's what you should have when you've actually done both the outlines of the wings. So all you need to do to finish off this kind of wing section is just fill it in. So just go around and just connect up all of these pieces with your grey wool. It's pretty easy. Uh, so do all that, and I'll show you what to do next. Okay, so once you've actually done kind of filling out of the wing, what you can do is if you come to the front, just place a stone stair right on the front here. And in this gap here, you're going to have four slabs. So you've got one, two, three, and four, just like that. 
And right here you're going to have three slabs as well, just on that section. So you've got four slabs in this part, one, two, three, four. And just in these gaps here you've got one, two, and three. Just like that. Okay, and if you come to the back, what you're going to do is you're going to have an upside down stair just on this piece that juts out slightly. And then put it on a couple stone slab, just like that. Grab your block of iron, and these are going to be your engines. So you can use block of iron if you want to. You can use glowstone, redstone block, whatever. And all I did is I just used iron block and put buttons on them as well. So you grab your cobblestone slabs and just go on the top of these and go one, two, three, four. Uh, just on all of these bits here. So this is a line up with the bit that we did underneath here as well. And now we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, and if you come to the front, grab your cobblestone slabs, just place down two slabs here. And you have one, and then just on the sides, you're just going to bring this one back pretty much all of the way back. One block short of the end and put down a couple stone slab. Same on the other side. So I just missed one there, nope. Okay, so just grab this back all the way. Just like that, and then grab your stair again and put a stair on each of these sides here. And also right on the back, there is going to be just a block right here and then a slab just to finish off that back piece like that. So now what we're going to do is we'll start building uh, the actual side engine parts, I think we can just complete those in one go, so let's do this. And then for the engine kind of intake parts, just on this part we're going to have a piece of blackboard here and here. And with your grey you're going to go one, two, three, four, just going backwards, and then you just have a one and a one until it joins in. And you can just fill this part in solid like this. And you go to the other side, do the same, so you've got black, black, then one, two, three, four in grey, and then one and one. And just fill this part in solid like that. And then just for a couple of slabs in this part, what you're going to do is you're going to have one, two, three here. So you're one block back from this part. And you've got one, one, and then one, two, and three like that. So then you're just going to fill in the rest of the gaps there with a couple more. So it just kind of snakes around it. Do the same on the other side. So this part, one block back, one, two, three. And you've got one, one, and then one, two, three. And then just put in the rest of your slabs like that. And we'll get on to the next layer. Okay, and then for the cockpit, what we're going to do is we're just going to place a block here just to place the glass on top, and you've got glass, and two pieces of glass on each side. Behind this, you've got two blocks just on each side, and then it comes in, and this is where it just goes all the way straight back. And it'll go on top of this block that you've got here. So it's pretty simple like that. And if you grab your cobblestone slab, we'll just finish off the roof of this, so you just have pretty much all of them on top. So for right at this part here, you can just have a couple there which will just finish off that cockpit part. So it is pretty small and this is pretty much the only kind of section we've got in this one, unfortunately. Um, but let's finish off this plane and then come on to this side part, we'll just finish off this. So you've got one, one, and one, two, three, four, five, and one, you've got an eight. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, which should be one back. So you've got this slab block slab on this back part. And then just fill this in as well with your slabs just like this, and same on the other side, so you've got one, 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 two, three, four, five, one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then just fill in this part as well, like that, and then we've just got the tail piece to finish up, I believe. Okay, and then to finish up the tail piece, what you're going to do is you're going to have five, so you've got one, two, three, four, five, four, one, two, three, four, and then three, one, two, three, and then a one just on this part here and then just add two onto the back ones here. Grab a slab, you're going to put a slab underneath this part here and also on this section like this. And then if you grab your stairs, all you need to do to finish off this build is just put a stair here and have five slabs. So you've got one, two, three, four and five. Just like that and that finishes off the build. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this tutorial on how to build an Avro Vulcan in Minecraft. If you have, make sure you comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you guys on the next tutorial.